brightest blessings, Minister. Yeah, I saw that comment from Phil Jackson as well. I know that you wanted um, responses to what people thought, especially if they happen to be gay or homosexual, or lesbian or bi or transgender, transsexual, whatever. I'm lesbian. I'm not bi. Plain old, straight up lesbian. And uh, I happened to have found it funny. Uh, I laughed. I thought it was. I thought it was quite hilarious. Um, and I do laugh at racial jokes too. Uh, you ever hear of a comedian by the name of Carlos Mencia? I love him. You know. So you know. I think the biggest thing was that that controversy about him stealing jokes. But what famous comedian has not stolen jokes? I'm not saying it's right, but when you get that big, you had to have stole some time in your career, much like being a politician. You can't get up to be the big boy, uh, to be in the big boy arena and run for president without being a major liar in one way or another. Anyway, <laughs> I like Carlos Mencia. He he's really really funny. In fact, I have an autographed uh, CD of some of his earlier work. Um, and I'd love to meet the man. I mean, he makes fun of everybody. He makes fun of people that are not of my particular race. He makes fun of people that are of my particular race. He makes fun of homosexuals. He makes fun of everybody. And the point is, is that he's got, uh, he, what he says, the point of what he says is, you got to lighten up, people. If you can't laugh at yourself, who the hell can you laugh at? Um... The thing is, is that I didn't see any malice in in what Mr. Jackson was saying. I just found it funny. It was innocent. You know, if someone says something and it has malice intent to it, okay, if people are just making fun of me for being gay or being of a certain race or a certain religion or fat or whatever, if it's got malice to it, you know what? I was not raised to sit there and hide and act like I am not better, uh, that I am not as good as you, okay? I am not going to take that crap, and I will be the first one in your face to tell you that is not right, and you had better back down. The thing is, is that there was no malice intended. It was a funny joke. Get over it. You know, I mean, that one was just right over the plate, Minister. I mean, I wouldn't have been able to resist swinging at that one. And I think one of my pet peeves, really, is when certain jokes can be told, but by only uh, people of the same race or by people that happen to be in that group. Oh, you can't say a joke with the N-word or, a, or a, bl a joke against blacks unless you happen to be black yourself. Can't say it against whites or, or uh, unless you happen to be white or of a certain race. You can't say any jokes about lesbians unless you happen to be gay. You can't say anything about, about any particular religion hap unless you happen to practice that religion because then it's okay, you know. Um, I don't particularly like the word well, as we have the N-word, we also have the F-word. That three-letter word that uh, is supposed to describe gays and cigarettes. Well, you know, I don't really like that word either, but, you know, I'll use that word occasionally, you know. And I hate it when people say, well, that's okay because you're gay. Well, either it's okay or it's not in the way that I use it. It has nothing to do with whether I'm gay or not. If it was done in a manner that is not acceptable, that has nothing to do with me being gay. And I can use it in just a destructive fashion as someone who is not. What is this crap about, well, you can do it because you're black, or you can do it because you're gay, or you can do it because you're Latino, or you can do it because you're, you're Christian, or whatever. No. No one's more special than anybody else. A joke is a joke, and it's funny if it's funny. And I should be able to do a joke about black people if it's funny. And you should be able to do a joke about white people if it's funny. And it shouldn't matter. You know? People need to get over their bad selves. Well, 
here's one lesbian in the gay community that says, gay people, get off your high horse. Laugh a little. Live a little. You know, because someday, someday, <sighs> blessed be.